The Church of Scientology has had its share of critics over the years and more than its share of negative press. The church has always fought back, but now the critics have harnessed a new platform, the Internet, and Scientology may have a harder time defending itself. Free Internet! Free Internet! Groups like this one called Anonymous are using cyberspace to challenge the church. We are Anonymous. We are Legion. The group's postings on YouTube generated heavy traffic. We want you to be aware of the very real dangers of Scientology. Anonymous recently staged protests in several cities, alleging, among other things, the church tears families apart, something the church denies. They don't care who you are, they disconnect you from your family. The group is made up of a growing coalition of anti-Scientology activists. Some say they're former Scientologists. They wear masks, they say, to shield themselves from potential harassment by the church and claim their actions are harmless. The Church of Scientology calls anonymous cyber terrorists who have polluted the internet with lies about the religion. And that's not all. January 2008, a message from anonymous is sent to the Church of Scientology. The church released this video to the media, alleging Anonymous made thousands of harassing phone calls to church members, including death threats. Anonymous says it has waged an online war against Scientology, but says it's not guilty of any hate crimes. It's a categorically false accusation. We want change, but through peaceful methods. The FBI told CNN it's investigating whether the group's online videos cross the line between free speech and illegal activity. First Amendment attorney Douglas Morrell says that's often a fine line that's open to interpretation. From a First Amendment perspective, everybody who speaks on the Internet has the right to speak so long as they're expressing their opinion and aren't defaming anybody. That doesn't mean that the church won't try to come after them. Legal experts say the church may be facing its biggest challenge yet, trying to protect its image in a loosely policed medium seen by millions of people. Kareed Winter, CNN, Hollywood.